Hey YouTube, so I'm back for another video. I have a 99 cent only haul and also a Dollar Tree haul. I picked up some stuff from the 99 cent store that I haven't found um, or I haven't seen at all. So they're all kind of new stuff that are new to the 99 cent store, I guess. Um, some just random stuff and then I have some food item stuff as well. So I'm going to get started with the 99 cent store because... That's I have a lot of the 99 cent store. So I'm gonna first start off with these. These are burlap ribbon. They're six feet, and it's by the brand. It's a party. It is the Momentum brand. So I believe in my Dollar Tree and my 99 cent store. When I see some hauls that people find at Dollar Tree, sometimes I don't find them at Dollar Tree. I actually find them at the 99 cent store. So I don't know if they're kind of related or they buy some of the same stuff I'm not sure but this is by the momentum brand and I found this burlap ribbon and it has the lace in the middle and I thought these were nice because for projects for really anything they're really nice then I picked up this one and this one has the lace on the bottom and the top so I picked up two of these I think they had one more pattern but I just thought these would be nice to pick up then I picked up these by the same brand and these are the mint green like napkins they're like the uh, beverage napkins and then they have like the foil gold on them then I picked up this one which is um, sorry the the Sun is a little bright here but the gold kind of foil but I picked these two up because when I do a lot of parties, they're mostly this type of color. Like, I always gravitate towards these colors. They did have the bigger napkins, but I didn't really care for them because when I do use these, they're more for, like, decorative purposes. So I picked up these two, and I thought they were really nice quality for uh, the 99 cent store. Then I picked up, by the same brand, these LED headbands. And I thought these would be nice for 4th of July. So I picked up this blue one. Then I picked up the red one. And I got these, one for my daughter and one for my niece. And it does have like the little thing on the back where you pull it out and it lights up. I also thought these would be neat for people that are going to Disneyland. And if you're going to the night parade and, you know, because it glows and it lights up I thought these would be neat for a Disney trip so I picked this one up for my daughter and my niece but they're gonna be for more for the July so I got those two then I picked up um, I'm gonna go into some of the stationery that I found they had a lot of stuff in this kind of like theme but I only picked up these these are glue sticks for my daughter and they have like the little pineapple, strawberries, watermelon, and the cupcakes. And they were like in this packaging. And I thought these would be neat for when she starts school because it has four in there. And I just thought they were like really cute. And she liked them. So we picked one of these up for her. Then these are more for me. Um, but also in this brand, they had a lot of stuff. I don't know if it's like a new brand coming in or I, I'm not sure. I think it's just a brand. I don't know. But I picked up these four washies. They say they're scented washies. And these, they ha did have another set, but these were like the cutest ones. They're the candy scented washi tape. And the patterns on them are so cute. Like this is a pie. Sorry, it's coming in and out. Ah, come on. Focus. It's going to be hard to... But it has like the candy cane. And then it also has like a, a, a donut and a cupcake. So these are cute. I guess they're supposed to be like scented. But I use washi for my planner and... These are so cute. So I picked up this. And this is the brand that is there at the 99 cent store. It's called Centos. And this one was the Sugar Rush. So now you can see it. 
so those are cute then i also picked up this my daughter picked this up for herself it's those scented rainbow pens and they're also they they've come out with these before like a long time ago when i was a kid um they're the ones that you push down the different colors and I'm guessing these are all like the the scents that they have. And this is the brand. Wait, that's not. Okay, so um I picked up one she picked up one of those for herself. Then I picked these up for my nephew because um he's going to be turning 8. And I thought I could put this in his like birthday bag and he could use these for school. And these are the Marvel Comics six pack pencils. So I picked these up for him. Then I just picked up some uh, of the bubble mailers and these are, they come two in a pack, but nothing special about those. Then I picked up these they've had these for a while there and they're the gourmet reusable they're the 12 ounce and these are for more like fruit and stuff i want to like wash the strawberries or the grapes or whatever and just put them in here and it comes three to a pack and then it has the pink lids and i thought these were cute even like for her school uh lunches i thought these would be good then I also picked up some toys and I'll get into the toy stuff because I found these. These are new to my Dollar Tree. I mean my 99 cent only store. So I found these. These are the Star Wars character bag clips. It says series one and there's nine characters. But I only found two of the characters I believe. Yes. I there were actually at the store there was three but only two I recognize so I picked up these they're the Star Wars and I think this is Darth Vader so I'm gonna give this to my nephew I think he likes Star Wars but I thought these were really nice and I could put this in his birthday bag and then I found I don't even know who this is to be honest I don't watch Star Wars I don't know who the characters are um, so I picked up this one and then, uh, these are the characters that are there, like the different ones. Oh, sorry. Uh, these are the different ones, but I've only, I only saw this one, this one, and this one. I didn't see this one there. So picked up those two. And then uh, my daughter picked this up. It says it's a cat pom pom key ring, um, and it's this little black pom pom with the little black ears, like the pink ears. And then it does have the little tail on the back. Um, she wanted this for her backpack, so they did have a, a white one or a pink one. Pink one and a black one. Uh, they had pink and black, but she bought, she got this one. Then we got squishies. Um, they had squishies there. These were ninety nine cents. Usually they're one ninety nine, and I bought in them for one ninety nine. But this time they're kind of a little bit different. You can see through the bags. So I picked up different ones. So I'll show you the ones that I picked up. They're by the Squeeze Me, they're Slow Rising Squishies, and these are honestly a great deal. If you know anything about Squishies, they're kind of pricey. So, I picked, these are the different ones they have. And these are like the characters all around that they had. So, I picked up the little blue dog, which is this one. And I just thought he was cute, and it, they are pretty squishy, like, they're pretty squishy. Um, I got the little blue one for my niece. Then I got the little, I don't even know. This is a little whale. But she's like right here. Then I picked up the little blue dog. The dark blue dog. The dark blue one. And then I got the little unicorn, the pink one. Because there was another purple and white one. But 
We only found the pink one. And I think she's right here. Then I picked up the little cat. We opened this one already, but this is the little cat. They did have a yellow cat, I believe. It's a little bright in here. orange. No, the yellow cat that you got and you gave to Naya. Naya, what's orange? It was orange? No, it shows yellow on here. So we got the pink little cat. She's right there. And then um, we got these. <laughs> they had like different colored ones that you can do. These are like more pink ones. And my daughter got these. <laughs> they have like um, different types of piggy banks. These are like piggy banks, but they had different animals. And she painted this one. So this one was a dollar ninety nine. I think this was more on the dollar ninety nine price, but. Um, she was painting it last night. Um, the paint on these, uh, they're not so great. Yeah, they're not so great because it kind of like smudges and it kind of leaves a weird film. So I would just use acrylic paint with, um, if you're going to do these. But these are neat. They're $1.99, something for them to do. Then, um, before I move on to the, uh, food items, I do have this. This is a sink caddy, and this was a dollar, so you put it like this on your sink, and you put your sponges in here on each side, or on one side, whatever, but I've seen these before at, like, Home Goods and Marshalls and TJ Maxx, but they had these, and I bought this for my sister when she moves into her house, I'll make a basket for her and put all this stuff in there for her like stuff she might need so I picked up that for her then I'm gonna move into the food items um, and then I'll go into Dollar Tree so I picked up this no calorie sweetener and these have 50 packs in them nothing too exciting but I picked up this one and then I picked up the stevia and this is the uh, zero calorie sweetener and oh, let me show it to you this way okay so uh, these and I'm, I'll be using these because I'm on keto or I'm trying to do keto so I bought these because those would be for my coffee then I did find the chewies these are eight granola bars and these are a great deal they don't expire until July 13th so these are good because um, kids are on summer break and my daughter recently started liking these and um, she could eat these as a snack since she eats snacks like 20 million times a day I also picked up these. She likes these and they're the Junior Dippers. And they're just the cheese with the uh, sticks on them. Then I also picked up these oatmeal creams from there. They're the brand Miss Freshly's. I kind of got quite a bit of food stuff so I picked up the um, Hormel pepperoni and I did pick these up and I thought these would be good snacks for me because um, you can eat these on keto and then I also got the hard salami and uh, I just eat them like that so I picked these up and I did already open them and they were good so I'll pick these up more often then I picked up the uh, lunchable they did have it there these um expire uh june 24th but my daughter will eat it it was the only one i found but it was 49 cents so i'm not sure why it was 49 cents but you know i'm not going to complain about that she wanted these these are the um I, I don't know if these are jelly and yogurt together they say you yogurt jelly i don't know but she wanted to try these and they come in like little containers so I picked that up for her I did find these there they're the spicy chicken sliders by the smart ones I picked up two of these I used to buy these when I used to do Weight Watchers and they are good so I picked two of these up for my husband I can't have bread so um, he could eat these you know as a snack and like I said, they are good and usually they cost about $3 at my local store, like grocery store. So 
I picked up two of those. And then I picked up some uh, Green Giant Baby Cut Carrots for a recipe along with um, some celery. And then I picked up this. This is a salsa con queso. And I just, by the Dakota brand. And I did open this up. I only got one. And they did, it did have different flavors of this. But I, I didn't want to buy like every single flavor. And then it'd be nasty and just be a waste. But I did open this one. And I can honestly say it's really good. Like we, my daughter was eating it with popcorn and cheese. Because we love popcorn and cheese like when you go to the movies I always get like the nacho cheese but she was eating it with this and it was actually really good I'm surprised that it was good and it was only a dollar now I purchased this on a Sunday and then yesterday no on a Monday and then I went yesterday which was Tuesday and I didn't see it, these anymore and I don't know they had like a white queso one so I want my mother-in-law got those so I wonder if those ones are good too. But this one, I can always honestly say it was really good. And it was only a dollar. And you know like this type of cheese, the ounces is 15 ounces. This type of cheese at a, your local grocery store can run 2 to $3. So I did like they, uh, I did like this. And a couple more things that I purchased. Um, I always get these for my husband there because they're a lot cheaper than the grocery store. Um, they're the micheladas. They're the chili and lime. If you know what micheladas are, you um, pour beer in here and then it has like a spicy, uh, like a packet in there. And then you put that on top. You're supposed to put clamato, but he normally doesn't. So I always buy these because he usually drinks these on the weekend. And they're like I said, they're cheaper at the 99 cent store than they are at the local grocery store. So I picked up um, three of these for him. And then I picked up just bread, the white sandwich bread. They normally have name brand bread, but yesterday since I went so late in the day, it was already gone. So I bought that one. Then I bought the dinner rolls, and this is an eight count. And if you're going to just eat it like that week, I think these are really good. My daughter will just eat them just like that. So then I bought these. These are the... The little mandarins and they're the little bag and these were $1.99 but my local grocery store they're about $3.99 so $1.99 is not bad for you know these and then I also bought bananas but they're over there here Layla put those over there okay so I'm gonna move on to the Dollar Tree items I picked up I picked up the hefty storage sliders So I picked up the bonus pack because it has eight bags instead of the regular, which is six. So I picked up that. Then I picked up these. These are for my daughter. These are the recycle activity kit. And it just says um, how uh, learn to recycle, peel and place stickers onto their matching containers. Four boards with 48 stickers. Um, this is what it looks like because we have two trash cans one where is recycle and the other one is trash but i always find her trash in the recycle so i want to teach her where and what bin she needs to be recycling so they do have the stickers on the back and i was thinking maybe i can put the stickers on the actual trash can so she can see but i wanted to see how these look if i can open this mm. So, okay so it comes with these and it says compost aluminum uh, paper and cardboard and then plastics so then you put these onto wherever it goes so i was thinking maybe i can put these on our bulletin board and then because you can see our bulletin board when you're throwing out you're gonna throw something in the trash or i might put magnetic strips and put these on the fridge i'm not too sure how i'm gonna have her use these or i'm thinking i might just have her put these on the trash can so she knows what exactly goes 
into what trash can, like on the front of the trash can. I'm not sure because um, these might be hard to take off later on. I'm not, like I said, I'm not sure. So I thought these would be good to just show her how to recycle. So that's that. Then I picked up this and this is the awesome oxygen base cleaner and I've seen a lot of people haul this but I have not found it at my Dollar Tree before. This is the first time I've seen it and I've heard it's good for the laundry. So I wanted to try this. Then I found Shopkins. Shopkins at the Dollar Tree. I always pick these up and these are the little shopping carts. And I picked up one in each color because they had teal, purple, and the yellow. And these are, I thought they were good. And I thought they were actually Shopkins. They're actually Shopkin puzzles with one Shopkin. So the puzzle is right here. And each one has different puzzles. And then this is the last one. And then it comes with one Shopkin. But I thought these were really cute because I like the little shopping cart and I just thought it was cute and I could use these as gifts for Christmas time for like stocking stuffers or just gifts. So I picked up three for my daughter and then um, three, which she already opened one, three for uh, like li my little stockpile where I have all kinds of toys. So yeah then i picked up these i thought these were a good deal i've seen a lot of people haul these and these are the keebler graham snacks and honey and they come they come six to a pack which i thought was a good deal for a dollar they did have the scooby-doo ones but i just picked up these Ugh. then this is the first time i've ever seen these at my dollar tree they're the uh, bath burst they call them bath burst but they're bath bombs and they're by the brand treat me and we found a couple of them i only had her pick up a couple of them there uh she picked up this one which is the heart and then she picked up the unicorn again these would be also good for christmas time so i might if i find them again like i said it's the first time i've ever seen them at my local dollar tree if i find them again i might pick these up for um for christmas time so Ugh, I have to reach over. Then I picked up these. These I've been seeing people haul and I've been wanting these. But I only wanted certain things. So I picked up the um, craft banner. And it's in kind of like the cardstock, that brown paper. Um, and it's supposed to look like this. So I picked up one and if you, I've done banners before and if it's already done for me, like what better way? It's only a dollar and it comes with, they're four by sevens and it comes with 14 sheets. And you could probably make two banners out of these, but I picked up one and then I found these. These are the craft sentiment stacks and it comes 48 sheets. And it's supposed to have all these um, in there. So I'm going to open this because this is the thing I was most excited about and I only found one. But I wanted these because my daughter does have the Instax Polaroid. Um, I have a little uh, um, photo album for her. And these would be good to put in there for like different types of things. And I wanted to see if they fit. So they have like all this foil stuff. And these are so pretty. I wonder if it does fit. I'm not too sure. I'll have to check to see if it does. Um, maybe I'll pause the video and go look. But these come with 48. And I just thought they were so nice. And I've bought in this type of like thing for my Instax. And they were not a dollar. So I was excited to find those. Then I found these. These are the Craft and Gold Mini Tags. And these come with 40 tags. They did have the bigger tags, but nothing that I wanted. 
and I think these were they only had one of these as well and I use a lot of tags I use them for like bridal showers baby showers uh, different stuff like if you're gonna give out little party favors these are so good to use even like these are like the different ones that they have Even if they're like different ones that you put on the gift tags, you know, these are so cute. You can write something on the back of these. these this is just an awesome deal for Dollar Tree. If I find these, I'm going to pick up another pack, but I thought these were like so cute. So I picked up those. Then I picked up these. These are actually for my niece and my nephew. I know it's a little early, but I'd rather pick them up now than later. I picked up two birthday cards. This one is for my niece. She'll be two, and it's a little Dora one. And inside it says, Today you'll find out what it's like to be two. Hope it's busy and filled with adventures for you. Happy birthday. Fe Feliz cumpleaños. So I picked up this one for her. And only one of my Dollar Trees had these. Um, I've been to like three in my area and I've only seen these at the uh, Dollar Tree that, one of my Dollar Trees. Um, this is the boy one and this says, hooray, you're two today. And it's the Sesame Street one. And this one says, look who's here from Sesame Street, especially for you with wishes and smiles to celebrate. Now that you're turn two, hope your birthday is great like you. So I thought these were so cute. And like I said, their birthdays, one's in December and one's in October. So I'm a little early, but it's okay. I'd rather just have them already. And then I believe this is the last thing I purchased. It's this collapsible storage container with dividers. It says perfect for organizing. And it's kind of big. It looks big. I thought it was big. But this would be good. I've seen people on YouTube use it for like their beach bags. I forgot who I was watching, but they, she used it for her beach bag. And it just got me thinking like, oh my gosh, I could put this inside my purse. Because my purse is the type that just kind of collapses. So I did open this and this is what it looks like. So basically it has a zipper on the bottom. And the zipper is what keeps it like sturdy um, and then this is what it is inside so I wanted to show you guys with my purse how you can use it in my purse now my purse is kind of like that type that just kind of flips it's kind of flimsy like um, it doesn't hold its shape because right now there's nothing in here and I wanted to show you guys how I was gonna put that in but so I'm gonna put this in my purse I have a whole bunch of stuff in front of me. So it does fit my purse. And it doesn't really, the collapsible doesn't weigh anything. So it's good. Okay, so this is what they in it. So as you can see, it actually has more of a form. And it fits like perfect. And I'm going to show you guys inside. And I just thought, oh my gosh, that's so neat. Like, you know how when your keys go everywhere in your your purse or I could put stuff on these now, like in here. But I think this is how I'm going to keep it because it actually um, holds my purse better like that. And it just, I can just stuff stuff in there and I don't have to be digging in the bottom of my purse for certain stuff. And it's really neat. And for a dollar, I might pick up more of these. The size on this is... Um, I'll just show it to you guys. So it's down here, but it's 9.75 inches by 6 inches by 6 inches. Okay, the last thing I wanted to show you guys to see if these actually fit inside the Instax um, photo albums. Because like I said, I have a photo album and it's uh, my daughter's and ours when we've gone on vacation. And as you can see, these are the type that go inside the instax they i bought them at uh not hobby lobby uh michael's before and they kind of just go inside and you just can write stuff on there or they could just be decorative purposes but i wanted to see if these fit in here like i said i bought these before see how they're like different ones so let's see if these fit they might be too small but that's okay 
Okay. Maybe, they might be small, but I think they'd be good. They'll be okay. Hmm. Yeah, no, they're okay. So I put one in here, and as you can see, it is a little bit small, but it's okay. The ones that I bought in before, let me show you. Okay, so this one, wait, where'd I go? So they look like this, so they're not exactly the same size, but it's okay, it'll do. Um, that's what I really bought it for, but they don't fit, but it's okay. You can use these for different types of projects and stuff, so that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is probably the longest video I've ever done. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys find some of this stuff in your, lo your local Dollar Tree and 99 cent only. If you guys have any questions, leave them down below. I, I, I'm going to be going to Hobby Lobby and I'm doing a laundry room makeover kind of type of thing. So hopefully I find some stuff and I can share that with you guys. And that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Say bye, Layla. Bye.